Hi, today I'm doing a review of Pigeon, which is a universal chat client that lets you chat with all your friends in one place, as put by them. But, um, basically that's what it does. It actually runs with a lot of IM clients. You can log, like, log in, let me find it. Uh, Yeah, okay, so you can have your AIM account, Bonjour account, Gadu Gadu account, Google Talk, Groupwise, ICQ, IRC, MSN, MySpace IM, QQ, SILC, Simple, Same Time, XMPP, Xfire, Yahoo, Yahoo Japan, and Zypher. And that's just by default. You can get third party plugins, and I'll leave a link for that in the uh, description bar. But there's, the, or actually, I'm using Xfire. I don't know if I said that or not by accident, but um, I use Xfire, which is a third party plugin. They also have a Twitter one, since everyone's obsessed with Twitter, but I personally don't use Twitter. And uh, I think it's about it with the third party plugin ones. And uh, this works with Linux, of course. I'm in Ubuntu right now, if you can tell. And, uh,. It works with Linux, of course, um, Windows, and then Mac OS X is apparently iffy. If you can't get Mac OS X running quite right, you can try Audium, which I'll leave a link for that in the sidebar, and Pigeon, and everything else. There will be a lot of links in the sidebar. But, um, basically, I, I like this, and I disabled my accounts, but I only use it for um, AIM, Xfire, and MySpace IM, but it works great. The only problem is if you try and use the third party Xfire plugin, at least for Linux, I've never tried it on AIM because I just used the Xfire on, or I mean on, my bad, not, not AIM, on Windows, I've never used the Xfire plugin because I just use Xfire there because, you know, they don't have it for Linux. And, um, at first when you log in, it, dis it says you're disconnected and then you push reconnect and you come back in to, and then it logs you out of Pigeon, which basically crashes and then you gotta open it back up. And then you gotta go up to accounts and then manage or edit, enable account. And then you go to your Xfire account. It comes up and it's got the same thing. So you gotta push reconnect. And that's how it works, at least for me. And it's worked every time I've tried to reinstall Ubuntu, which I install Ubuntu and other things a lot. I don't know why, but I do. I play around with Mint and all that. But um, overall, I think I'll give the look and feel of this probably a 9 out of 10. Because they're, I don't know, it's not the prettiest thing. But as far as performance goes, it's where 10 out of 10 in the third party plugins, a little bit less, but <laughs> that's expected. But, um, thanks for watching. I'll leave some links in the sidebar. Thanks.